Welcome back everybody. Long time no see. It's been a while since I put out a video. We ain't really had much going on that I could really film. We've had the 4440 in. Kind of working on it a little bit. Power strokes in the shop. Putting a fuel pump and different fuel filter system all around on it. But uh, there's something that is uh, going on tomorrow, which is Tuesday. And I got Monday off since it's President's Day. So I'm an FFA. Most of us farm kids are, but uh, one thing I've been wanting to make a video on, but I only was able to do last year because the year before, weather really wasn't suited for it, so I just drove my Grandpa Bronstein's old 77 Ford short bed, but uh, last year we had tractor day. I drove the MX240. I had some footage last year, but not enough to really make a video, so this year I took it upon myself and a few of us did. We're going to make it the biggest one our school's ever had because a lot of kids just never did understand anybody could do it. Everybody thought it was only FFA, but that's not the case. Anybody can do it. So I'm bringing the old 40, 430. Figured I redid the old girl and got her all shined up and cleaned up. A buddy of mine came by and helped me yesterday. And the night before that, another buddy of mine came and we waxed it all up, got the windows washed. But left it set out last night so there's a little bit of dirt on the hood from the frost and all that so i wiped it done good so it's good to go so tomorrow morning i'm gonna leave here about well after six meet my cousin at the end of my highway he's bringing his grandpa's 4640 and we're gonna go meet some other guys at one of our neighbors bin sites and probably be about four or five of us meet there and rolling to school together and we'll all be out in the parking lot and i'm gonna try to get as much footage as i can we're gonna make a pretty good video out of this one so Yep, it's going to be a good day. Quite a few of us bringing tractors. I actually was just at another buddy of mine who's going to meet us at the Ben site. Helped him get the interior put in his tractor. He's got a 4630 with a loader his dad bought. And uh, it needed interior, so I helped him clean it up yesterday. And we started putting the interior in yesterday afternoon. We had two pieces go and it got cold. They don't have a heated shop we could have put it in. So metal was getting cold and it wasn't wanting to stick, so we just didn't mess with it anymore. And I came back here at noon and finished it up. And it's good to go. So I moved 4430 here, filled it up as you've seen. It's here ready to go for tomorrow morning. So I'll see y'all tomorrow morning, bright and early. Well, the morning's come. My cousin Cooper is just pulling in here bringing a 1206 but he's going to go ahead behind me he's got one of the neighbors behind him and we're going to meet my other cousin Skyler at the end of the highway and we're all going to roll in together so we're about ready to head out I think he's missing some headlights Grandpa's in front of us with the service truck flagging for hills. I got a whole line up behind me. Cousin on a 1206, neighbor in a 1086, and other cousin on a 4640. We're going to meet about three more rigs at the neighbor's bins. It 
4640, With. We got them all fired up. We all left a little early. Brady's got some visitors over there. He got his tractor fired up. Colton's got the new haul and Cooper's getting ready on the 1206 over there. It's it's going to be an interesting ride home. We're going to take a different road than we did this morning, but we should be good.